Mr. Tanji Se finished third in the presidential election with 25.04% of the vote count. 529,732 Singaporeans voted for Mr. Tan. Flanked by his wife, Madam Patricia Koo, and four children, Mr. Tan walked into Bedok Stadium at midnight amidst shouts and cheers from 1,000 odd supporters who stayed on after the first counting of the votes. Even though he already knew he was behind in votes, Mr. Tan kept his head up. Well, they were saying whether uh, I, the, how did the, 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 the sentiments on the ground that there's a contest between uh, two leading, um, I said that's about right, you know. Yeah. Before the results were officially announced, Mr. Tan has already addressed the supporters and the media. He was adamant that the time frame given for campaigning and the image of him being over-confrontational were the two reasons for his defeat. I am not confrontational, um, so, but it's the image that has been created. So I have not gone out into the streets to wave my hands and throw stones. Mr. Tan said that three months would be a good time frame for campaigning. Midway through the campaign, more people became know more about me and what I stood for, and I was able to re, to reply to respond to many of the criticism allegations against me against me. If I had been given a longer period, I would be able to achieve uh, a more. Uh, uh, I'll be able to convince more people. Despite his defeat, Mr. Tan believes that Singaporeans want a president who will challenge the government of the day. As to whether he plans to run in the next general election in 2016, Mr. Tan said he will discuss this with his supporters.